Zika virus could cost region up to 18 billion US dollars UN report. A new United Nations report has found that in addition to the impact on public health, the mosquito-borne Zika outbreak could cost the Latin American and the Caribbean region as much as 18 billion US dollars between 2015 and 2017. The report titled Socio-Economic Impact Assessment of Zika Virus in Latin America and the Caribbean prepared by the UN Development Programme, UNDP, in partnership with the International Federation of Red Cross and Red Crescent Societies, IFRC, has a particular focus on Brazil, Colombia, and Suriname, countries that first reported the outbreak in October-November 2015. The UNDP Assistant Administrator and Director of its Regional Bureau for Latin America and the Caribbean, Jessica Faita, underscored the far-reaching impact the Zika virus would go, beyond tangible losses, such as to the gross domestic product, GDP, and could potentially impact the implementation of the 2003 UN Agenda for Sustainable Development. The consequences of the virus can undermine decades of social development, hard-earned health gains and slow progress towards achieving the Sustainable Development Goals, SDGs, she said. The UN said the assessment also clearly showed that the impact of the virus was felt the most in poorer countries. While larger economies, such as Brazil, could bear the greatest absolute burden, the most severe impacts are likely be felt in the poorest countries, such as Haiti, the UN said. Zika reminds us that all countries and peoples remain vulnerable to emerging infectious diseases, and that a disease that primarily affects poorer populations has wide-ranging social and economic implications for entire communities, said Magdi Martinez Solomon the UNDP Assistant Administrator and Director of its Bureau for Policy and Program Support. The UN said the impact assessment also highlighted the need to strengthen regional and national preparedness and response strategies, which also involve communities and have particular focus on the needs of vulnerable group, such as girls, women, and persons with disabilities. The Zika virus has highlighted, once again, the critical role that communities and local health workers play during health emergencies, said IFRC Regional Director for the Americas Walter Cott, highlighting that community engagement strengthens local partnerships, resilience, and reduces stigma. We must continue to promote coordination at all levels and strengthen the Red Cross role as an auxiliary to public authorities, he said.